We have a professor who addressed a transgender student as Mr. And the transgender student wants to be addressed as Ms. University policy says that the professor is required to use the pronoun or the title that that individual student prefers. The professor, on the other hand, has a religious belief. He believes that God created male and female and that those cannot be changed and that he has to follow that when he's teaching in class. Eventually, the university reprimanded him and told him that there would be more discipline coming if he continued to violate the university policy. Now, the Sixth Circuit came in and said, hey, this prof has a free speech right to do this, which I think is just totally wrong. They also said that the university violated his uh, free exercise of religion, which I think is probably correct. On the free speech part, there's the Garcetti case from the US Supreme Court which basically says, uh, if you're speaking out as a citizen, you have free speech rights, but if you're speaking pursuant to your official duties as an employee, you do not have speech rights. And the Sixth Circuit just basically turned that upside down and said, oh, well, this speaking in class is the heart of his duties, and therefore he has free speech rights. I, I think that's just totally wrong. On the other hand, on the free exercise part, the university clearly was hostile to his religion. Uh, in fact, there was a provost at the university who actually laughed during one of the hearings, laughed at his religious belief. So this case is half right and it's half wrong. Uh, in any event, the Sixth Circuit has sent it back for a trial.